How's it going guys? Today I'm going to actually be showing you how to fix your capacity limit on your server. Because we all know how annoying it is when you got a private server running and it's a pain in the butt to try to get everything to work. Now this one's going to be the G Portal version only because I only use G Portal. As you can see the jitter is pretty normal for a server. And just to show that I'm not, you know, BSing or anything like that. 20 capacity right here on an actual private server because you know one out of ten jitter yada 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 whatever blah 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 so i'm going to basically be showing you how to allow 20 capacity usage on your private server too so less yapping let's get to work let's do this here we go all right so this right here if you're messing with g portal right here so the way that you're going to have to do this is you're going to go to file manager pal saved saved games zero whatever your save file number is then right here is where we're going to be slapping in the override file the website which i'll be putting a link in the youtube description you're going to go here Basically, you're going to select all your settings like you normally would. Set it up how you want. Power worker number only goes up to 20. I had mine set to 40 just to see if it can go higher. Doesn't work, unfortunately. Then once you get all the way down here to the bottom, you don't hit export pal world settings, blah, blah, blah. That's single player. You want world save. When you hit generate, it's going to download it to your computer. Then from here, you're just going to hit upload. You can either drag it or click it, and then you just click one, uh, either one of these. I already had one on my computer. Once you do that, it'll drop it into here, and then just restart your server. That, that's it. And then once you log in, and then the best way to tell is you go to your PAL box. You press V like you're going to upgrade. If your box is already max level 20, you'll see it. If not, then you'll just have to find out once you start seeing the number go past level 15. Aside from that, you guys take it easy, and I'll see you guys in the next video.